In this short video, we're going to show you how to create a custom shape in STAD Pro Connect Edition. The first thing we're going to do is go to the Workflow Page Control area and select the Properties page. And you're going to notice that the Specification tab has automatically become active. Now instead of using the Sections database or creating a prismatic section, we're going to create a user table to create a custom wide flange section. So the first thing I'm going to do is go to the user table icon and select create user table. Now I'm going to create a new table. It's going to be a wide flange type of section. We'll go ahead and click OK. Now once I've created a new table, I can create several new properties or whatever I need for this particular model. So let's go ahead and click add new property. And here you can see I'm already set up to enter a wide flange section. Now this could be especially useful if you are taking a look at maybe a historical building which has older wide flange sections which are not currently part of the standard database. So I'm going to create a section property for a 24 WF by 76. So I'm going to enter in all of my properties in these fields over here. Now once I've entered my basic section properties, I can use STAD Pro to automatically calculate the cross-sectional area, your moment of inertia, your torsional constant, and even your shear area for sections defined in a user table. And to do that, I'm going to go ahead and just click on this Calculate button. And you can see that it was able to use this information to get the rest of these values. Once we're done, we'll go ahead and click OK to finish up that section. Now I can create some additional section properties in this user table if I needed to, um, but at this point let's go ahead and um, click the close button. Now I've created a new user table and now what I want to do is I want to assign that section to maybe a member in my model. So I'm going to go back up to user table and I'm going to say assign from user table. It's going to automatically find the user table. I'm going to select the section that I just created. If you created more than one section property, you're going to see a list here. And I'm going to select my material as steel. And then I'll go ahead and click the Add button. And basically, from here on out, it looks like the standard database, where I'm just going to click Close here. And then I'm going to assign this section to my model. So let's just go ahead and say Assign to View. I'll assign it to both my beams and my columns. And now again, if I go to my 3D rendering, I'll be able to see that that section property was successfully assigned. Now STAD Pro will allow you to create and use customized steel section tables for property specification, code checking, and also member selection. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you and see you next time.